morning. Morning. Oh, I'm Paul sorry. and Paul. Good morning. Good morning, Chris. Good morning, Hi. Paul. Good morning, guys. Me and Paul were trying to sneak up on this alligator that he says he discovered yesterday. And it, it these wild animals, I swear, they just they disappear. It's like they don't want to see us, and they just whatever. Boom. They're gone. But uh, anyway, we're fishing. It's been a while. Been a while. I'm out here. Finally out here. You know, I know people have been asking me, hey, Chris, where's Paul? What's that, you know? And, and I've been saying, listen, go watch his channel. Uh, Horsley Retirement Adventures. Mm -hmm. You know, get on there and subscribe and get on his channel and stuff. Yeah. You know, and people on his channel have been asking, hey, where's Chris? Yes, and, sir. You know, Paul's yes, like, sir. I don't know. Chris, don't know Chris who? I don't know. But uh, anyway, now that I'm back, then I can take control of the situation. Mm -hmm. And uh, we're just kind of drifting along in this river. There's that a bird over gone. there. There's really no point. We're just, whatever. The gator's so, gone. Gator's gone. I'm going to stop this. Um, introduction. I'm going to stop this introduction. Look at that sunrise. Look at that sunrise. Woo. Brother. And now this is it. The next time you see one of us. We're having a fish. Somebody is going to be catching a fish. Mm-hmm. We're going to catch a fish and catch you later. Yeah. I get it. Fish catch. All has a drum. We're going for giant drum today. Yeah. Giant drum. And uh, so far, we, this that. is the guy. This is our version. Now, your idea of a giant drum might be a little different. I don't know. Yeah, there he is. Giant drum. I'll picture that. A <laughs> hundred times bigger. Paul. All Paul needs is a little distraction. Fixing my reel, and then this guy bit my jig. This is a fish, Chris. Shh. Oh, he's gonna make me quiet. Sorry. Shut up and fish. Mm. Stop. Mm. She said. It's pretty. I'm kind of busy right now getting this. Because it, when it's when the line's tangled around the end of your pole, it really doesn't matter how much line you let out. You can keep letting line out and it, it just stays right there. It's just the craziest thing. That's what happened to me. Now, no. folks. Have you ever. He's kind of an odd shape, isn't he? Mm hmm. For a sheep's head, he's long. Long, weird looking guy. You might think I'm a sissy, yeah. and I am. I no. am a sissy. No, mm -hmm. you just got to know your limitations. Nah, he's not a big one. He's got a big one though. It's not one of the big ones, but it's a big one. It's for me. In oh, Chris's, nice, nice drum, though. in Chris's world, this. Oh, you want oh. A you want a glove? I got a rag or a glove. Nah, or... A Those don't hurt you. No, these are nice. Fish. Those are nice fish. Let's nice, tell you soft what. guys. Mm -hmm. Cushy. These are the most beautiful fish I've caught today. It is. Head. Man, I'm on the big fish mm -hmm. pattern today. I'm not messing around, guys. I think Chris is, catch, is uh, catching fish for the aquarium. I'm serious. I'm serious. Mm -hmm. I'm tired of messing around. Yes, sir. I'm going for the champions. I'm going straight. Be careful. Those are the ones that will get you. I'm going straight for Look the trophy. That. Yeah, those. Oh, oh, Paul got a bite. Paul got a bite. That's my normal. I said, "Look at that!" and something hit my yeah. shrimp. Yeah, that's Paul's. That's what I do. I don't pay attention. Modus operandi. What? What did you call that's, it? <laughs> your mo. Oh, okay. You know what mo? Mo is. Not kind yeah. Of what that is. Oh, mo. Yeah. Yeah. Okay. That's my mo. Modus something. Or method of operations. Method. Yeah. Methodist operations, Methodist. like if you get an uh, operation and the doctors are Methodist. Oh, yeah. Methodist yeah. operations, or the person's a Methodist. Yeah. Another fish, Chris. Chris, on. Chris on. It's a little bit bigger. Okay. A little bit bigger. I'm raising my standards. Yes. Don't let that back fin get you. Take it easy, fella. I had to put my cure comb all over my hand yesterday when I got home. <laughs> Do they still make that? <laughs> I thought that was outlawed. The Kirikon? Yeah, I thought that was only available like no, in Eastern right Europe or I got China. I right the iodine. Now, the, <laughs> the, the uh, castor oil? Yeah. I've right next to the castor oil? Yeah. Now I'm getting into the big guys. Right? Ooh, Ooh, yes. That is nice. Monster. Almost. I like the color on him. He is a uh, albino. I spray way up here. Hopefully I didn't get nothing on your lens. I mean, it got in my eyes. Because I'd be hearing about that all day. I all got day. a... Chris just caught another fish. He is killing it. Paul sprayed bug spray in my eyes, trying to stop my 
onslaught. Great bugs spraying your eyes. My onslaught of fish that is I have happening right now. Paul, his only defense is to try oh, to blind me. GoPro, start recording. Paul is on. Paul is on. Paul is on. Massive. Paul is on. Okay. What happened? I think this guy. How did you feel that? No, he really had a. He was much bigger. <laughs> When I hooked him, you think something. I think the big You think fish. he knocked off the big yes. fish and got on there? What are you doing? Uh, Should I go up there uh, away from the trees? No, I got him. I got this guy. I'm in charge of him. He's not in charge of me. Oh, he's in charge of me. Paul's in charge of the net. Chris has a big fish. Uh, are you sure you want me to move away from these trees? No. What did I say? I didn't say move away from the trees. <gasps> Get the bait first. Without the bait, we are nothing. Hey! Yes. <sighs> That's the kind of cheap head we were looking for. Okay, I'm gonna lip this guy. Be careful. Put him up and I wanna take a picture with this. My Pro Pro. GoPro. Look how skinny he is. He's shaped like that other one. These are like hybrid okay. drum sheeps. Oh, Paul's taking. Mm -hmm. Picture. Smiling. Oh, oh yes. Yeah. Okay, That's dude. Beautiful. Measure him. Huh? No. Okay. Where's the zero? Am I backwards? Nineteen. Yeah, right at nineteen. Nineteen. Good um, real action there too. I'm not here to play around, Paul. I'm here. This is a business trip. Chris is back on. Wait a minute. Oh, I saw yes, that on. Yes, sir. Uh, he was laying on the bottom. America's got talent. Yeah, he was laying on the. Oh no, oh, it's in his mouth. Oh, he got him. He wasn't foul. Hey, ho, 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 ho. Now I these foul hooks for a second are the guys that will injure you. Yeah. They're just little enough to flop around enough to stab you. Okay, we got a snapper. Got a little snapper. That's good. Is that, you want to keep that? Yes, I do. Okay. Or I may want to keep it myself. Paul, just catch your fish. Before you start telling me what to do. You may try on your... Do I need to do anything? You can turn that on. Like push the top? No, I do. You don't want to My God. I still don't understand how your Paul's got the yeah. bring that fish in. You got brothers. They are. I think these guys really are related. Yeah. <laughs> got this one. I got Paul. Oh, he's a fighter. Paul's got one. It's a good one. Yeah. Trying to video this. Trying to make this kind of build dancey. I tried to mm -hmm. this is kind of fish that get me. This was Paul's hot spot yesterday. If you want to go back and watch his video, recommend. I highly recommend. I yeah, the look on your face. Because, you know, Paul acts like he's a nice guy. He's all happy, go lucky. But when something doesn't go his way, he is. Mm, mm, Mr. Mean Guy. Mr. Mean Jean. That's what I call him, Mr. Mean Paul. Mean. Kind of like this fish is mean, yes, yeah. sir. Mean Paul, the Bring fishing him machine. Ooh, Come here. He's a. Is this a keeper? He looks like he's. I think like he's it. he's borderline. You know what? If I can clean goldfish from the supermarket. <laughs> goldfish. <laughs> Paul likes I can a. Play a goldfish. I can play that. Paul likes a nice big goldfish fillet. Sure. Right here, there. are actually inshore for mangrove snapper in georgia you could catch any catch any size you could keep any size yes. there's no Good. size limit it's kind of like a professional wrestling match no Dang. so you like that wrestling match me and that shrimp just had you know he pinned me and these guys are mean 
I'm not saying mother may I. No. I'm saying get He's... me my crab. Kill the crab. Oh! Oh, wow. Oh, yeah. oh, 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 oh. So you won't tie onto their dot, but you'll sit out in their yard going, Woo! <laughs> Wake up, folks. Equipment issue there. Okay, here we go. Chris on. Chris on. I'm going to tell you what I did there, Paul. It's a little secret right there. That's up. That's a clean That's a keeper. I can't. I don't want to Because I'm going to see if I catch up another fish. If I do, then I'm going to tell you. You got a fish on? Yeah. Yeah, got him. Okay, I'm going to. Oh! oh, that was a nice. That's a good one. I'm going to tell you what I did, Paul. What did you do? I lowered it down yes, sir. that far. Oh. Because I was thinking my shrimp keeps go into the top of the water to get away from them yeah so if i can keep him down there a little bit well that's touch deeper i mean that's good for you but not for them shrimp then maybe i'll catch I mean, the fish smart, i mean he's not huge he's a guy he's, big, he's bigger than the last he's a guy last one. he's a guy oh he's a keeper nice one paul that was a nice one good job I'm so proud. Oh, it's right into my coffee cup, but that's all right. Man, my coffee tastes like shrimp and fish. Shrimp and fish flavored coffee. Man, that was like lightning struck my bobber. Fish. Somehow we've ended up. Okay, little Timmy. No, no, the answer is no. The question is, Chris, did you just catch that fish? The answer is like just... no. Trout, I believe. Here it comes. Okay. Chris got trout. Oh, I just got one. I almost got a trout. Chris's trout is in doubt. Oh, he got off on the shell bank. Yep. When I tried to get him across. Yep. You say yep like you knew what was going to happen. Yep. I'm not surprised. I got ready for him. Ooh, he's, he's got some meat to him. Ooh, doggy. You want to nut him? Uh, yeah. Yeah, why not? Why not? You haven't said one word about my new net yet. I love your new net, Paul. I'm, I'm trying to see how it does right here. Of course, it did okay with that sheep's head. That's a good net, Paul. Thank you. It's a good net job and a good net. Nice fish. That's him. Uh, do you want them? Huh? I mean, I'm gonna definitely keep the sheep's head. I don't know that well, I want to clean one fish. You might have cleaned two. Might as well. That's my rule. That's exactly. No. Now, what Chris did is throw out there limits where I can throw where there's no fish. <laughs> I don't know if you guys seen that. That is not true. Hmm. Now I can only. You can throw right can there. Throw. Well, the longer you wait, the less space you have to throw. Don't go to the shells. I'm standing on ready, Paul, with the net. Turn around. No, he did. Thank you. God, this guy's a good listener. He is a smart. It's a kid. pleasure to catch a good listener like this. There you go. Get out there in the open. You don't want to go over to the shell bank. Folks, that fish was heading right into the shoreline until I told it to turn around. So I appreciate. You got to communicate. You got to talk to your fish. With these fish. If you want them to do what you want, you have to talk. Now I got to get it over this bank so it don't. That's good. Hit a shell. 
That's a good fish, Paul. Yes, sir. Man, I'm so excited. Is it hooked sideways or something? something. Foul hooked? Oh, it is. It's a lady fish is foul hooked. Are you kidding me? No. Are you sure it's not yeah. a trout? Foul hooked? I'm pretty sure it's a lady fish. Woohoo! Uh, oh. <gasps> okay. Well, I'm not going to use. I just throw that out there for, for, for a shark? I'm not going <laughs> to use the... God, we were all excited over a trash fish. Not like ladies, but. Now that makes sense why that bite was the way it was a while ago. It's got a big fish. It's got what you call a flounder. And that's going to be dinner for Chris. If it's big enough, I don't know. Hmm? So I don't know 100% sure if it's big enough. If it's oh, not, it's a little shoot. one. I got my nut right for nothing. <sighs> so disappointed. I mean, I'm glad I caught a flounder. I show my audience what a flounder looks like. So they all seen them. But, um, I mean, mine are much bigger than this ones I catch, but these are this is what they look like. <laughs> is mine, my, is my thing recording? Oh, I'm sorry. Move it around. Yep. Okay. Now that we've determined that Chris is recording. Get mine out of the way. Whew. You didn't get off, did you? No. It's not a flounder. Yes, it is. Yes. Another little one. What? It's not even a flounder anymore. Oh, it's a trout. It turned into. <laughs> it turned... We're magic. <laughs> this is magic today. The magic show Look with Chris and. Come here. Woo! Flounder trout. That's a nice trout. That's a good trout. That is. Here. Um, I'm going to wait two minutes and I'm not going to give him this to him. Wow, it's a nice trout. Look at that guy. Okay. okay. You look at that guy. Okay. That's a good looking trout. Woo. Make you want to fish a little longer. <clears throat> Be the last fish of the day, guys. Let's see what it is. Let's go, Chris. Probably is the last fish of the day. Fight it, baby. Fight it. I have Fight a it. feeling. Oh. I have, oh, a feeling. You ready, Nanny? That it might be. A sh shark! That was not the feeling that I had. Okay, guys, that Alrighty. that will make it the last fish that of the. And I mean, I'm not even the captain, and I'm calling it. Hey, can I put that one in my aquarium? He's small. Usually, the captain calls the day. Yeah. Calls it done. Done. But Paul's already tried to call it done several times, and I've overruled him. I said, Paul. Think you are. I'm not leaving. Look at I caught the shrimp. Paul caught three shrimp. I caught How did I get all three of them on there? That's man. Hmm. I challenge everybody out there to catch three shrimp like Paul did. The three shrimp challenge. Thanks for watching, guys. Bye!